Good afternoon. Uh, just talking about the uh, game last week, we had opportunity to uh, to be in the driver's seat, and unfortunate enough, we didn't come away with the uh, victory that we thought we would, uh, and, and, and that's very, very disappointing when you talk about that situation right there. But at the, uh, the end of the day, we, we, we came back and we understood uh, where we went wrong at some of the uh, mistakes that we made, uh, uh, the, whole, the whole team. But the biggest thing is that the, the, the guys understand that at this point right now, uh, you don't control everything that's in front of you. But what you do control is the next game. And that's the uh, Prairie View game, which is a very important game. And also, you have the opportunity to control your academic situation, where you are and where you want to be at. At the end of the day, you want to be able to graduate, and then you want to be able to play uh, successful football. So there's some things we clean up, some things we know we continue to work on. And, and it's not uh, reinventing the wheel. There's some things that we, uh, we put on the, uh, on the front porch, some things that we have to take care of. And uh, now moving forward into a challenging game right here, a team that uh, I know all so well and know me as well. Uh, a lot of coaches work together. Uh, some of the same schemes that we are very, very familiar with. But it just comes down now who, uh, who wants it the most. And I, I do know that our team would be prepared and up for the challenge. Coach, overall, uh, since in about the last month, has your team improved, plateaued, or uh, gone backwards a little bit? In, in certain spots, you know, when you look at it, uh, it they, they improve in a lot of different spots. When you take a look at the, the penalties, some uh, penalties are, uh, I mean, you, you can't control these aggression penalties, and some penalties are just merely just concentration, and that's the part that we harped on. When we started out within the first four games of this season right here, we was the least penalized team in the conference. Uh, we wasn't getting as many penalties. Now we're getting those penalties, and, and they're not, uh, in some cases, they're a whole lot, but they're crucial penalties uh, at certain times and situations that can change the magnitude of the football game. Even right now, uh, you, you you know you talk. I don't talk about other schools, but you got schools that that have uh, that's in first place, or what have you, but are leading the conference in in penalties. So those things we we got to work on. Some things you don't control, but the thing that I'm going to control, uh, and that's why you know you bring in coaches uh, with experience, things people that can spread out and and help you uh, correct certain things. I do understand. I'm the head coach, and I'm always take charge of it. But I do understand this here. You can't do it all by yourself. You have to have good people around you that's going to help you, support you, to lead you to do the things that, that would help you to be successful. So, you know, when you bring in a guy such as a Willie Todd and you bring in a guy such as a Terrence Graves, they can help you get through those type situations to where you can kind of touch everything that's within your uh, organization. What is the biggest issue for the offense? It's obviously not functioning like it was about a month ago. Consistency. Uh, consistency, things happen here and there, and I, I'm I'm not an excuse guy. That's why you're not gonna never hear me say that. But you have a player here or there that may get injured. That's not in that puzzle. That makes that puzzle different. Now you got to find another piece of blood. But we do have guys that got to step up. That's always in in sports. The next man up. You got to get that opportunity. It's your opportunity now. But uh, the bottom line is consistency. We got to be able to uh, compete at a high level and execute at a high level, and, and it takes all 11 guys.